Hey everybody and welcome back to Misfit Corner Scams. This is the Yards Knows Andrew speaking and it's time for another scam call. Actually this is two of them. Back to back scam calls that I got on the home number. Both of them claiming to be from my electric provider. Both of them offering me money back. And both of them just absolutely hilarious. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the call. And remember if you ever get calls like this, either hang up on them. Or screw with them like I do, because sometimes it's a lot of fun. And if you like these videos, and you like the content here on this channel, like and subscribe. We do daily videos, plus daily shorts, and we live stream on Saturday nights at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We have a really nice community. Come on by for some Q&A, and hope to see you there. Thanks a lot for checking out the video. Hello, my name is Noel Wilson. How are you doing today? Oh, very good, thank you. I am fine, thank you so much. I'm calling you in regards to your electricity bill. So are you the one who pays the bill every month? Yes, yes I do. Uh, excellent sir, so you are qualified for a $50 rebate every month for the next 12 months. So can you tell me, are you getting any assistance from the government to pay your bills? Or do you pay your bills by your own? No, no, I, I take care of the bills myself. Okay, and sir, do you live in one key Campbury? I'm sorry? Unit 101 East? No. I'm saying, do you live in one Camprey? One key Camprey? I have no idea what you're talking about. Is that the I address? I address. Are you Mr. David? Yes. And I have your address as one key Capri in Treasure Island, Florida. Is that correct? Treasure Island, Florida? I've never heard of that location. Are you 72 years old? Yes. Uh, another address that I have under your name is One Drive East. Now what company are you That's calling from? What company are you calling from? It's a Public Utilities Commission of Florida. That's not my electric provider. Yeah, I know that's not your electric provider. It handles all the electric providers in Florida. Really? As you are a senior citizen and you pay your bills on time and you never get any help from the government to pay your bills, that's why you are qualified for this benefit. I have this strange you feeling... You can give me your address, sir. I have this strange feeling you're lying to me. Okay, no problem. It's up to you. Have a nice day. Liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Trying to take advantage of senior citizens. Evil people. Is regards your electricity bill that you have been overcharged from a couple of months. But we are going to give you a rebate, $290, okay? Oh, okay, that's fantastic. Just let me clear, are you getting any kind of assistance from government to pay the bill? Am I getting assistance from the government? No, no, I paid the bills are myself. You? Okay, are you the homeowner or renter? I am the homeowner. Okay, sir, just let me clear, how would you like to get rebate amount, $290, through your debit card or credit card? Which one do you have? Um, well, I have a credit account, a credit card account. Okay, sir, do you have a credit card? Yes, sir. Okay, sir, it is a Visa credit card or MasterCard credit card? Uh, well, hold on a second, let me pull it out and I can take a look. Give me just one second. Okay, I'm holding the line for you. Okay. Uh, let's see here. This is my Capital One MasterCard. Okay, sir. What is the number on the card? The the account number, you mean? The, uh, in front of the card, you will see a long digit number. Yes, sir. Uh, it's, you ready? It's 5178-0576. Three one eight four eight two one one. Okay, sir. So, what is the expiration date of the card? Oh, uh, let's see here. Six of twenty six. Okay, sir. So, just let me clear. For in the back of the card, you will see three digit number. Okay, I got that. Okay, what is the number? Two, two, one. Okay, sir. So what is your mailing address? 611 East Adams Street, 
Jacksonville, Florida, 32202. Okay, I got you, sir. Okay. Just let me clear. 32202, am I right? Yes, that's my zip code. Okay, sir. Sir, are you paying your bill by yourself or are you getting any kind of help from the government? No, I pay the bill myself. Okay, sir. Sir, you will... Uh, just let me call you in a city water or do you have a well pump? What? Are you in a city water or do you have a well pump? I, I'm on city water. Okay, are you paying your... Uh, okay, just let me clear. Are you on a city sewer or do you have a septic tank? No, a city sewer as well. It's all from the same thing. Okay, sir. What appliances do you have by luck today? What appliances do I have? Yeah. Uh, a refrigerator, a stove, a dishwasher, a washer and dryer, just normal stuff. Okay, sir. Do you have a water heater? A water heater? Well, yes, yes, I do. Uh, how old are these appliances? I, I honestly, I'm not really sure. I know I've had them a while. Okay. Probably 10 year old, more than 10 year old. I don't know if it's been that long, to be honest with you. Okay, sir. Just let me clear. Are you the homeowner or a renter? Homeowner. Okay, sir. I got you, sir. Sir, do you have an email address? An email address? Yeah. Do no, have... I don't. I don't normally use my an email address. So this is a formality. That's why I'm asking you. If you had any email, just say yes and tell the email. Well, then the answer would be no. I don't have an email. Okay, sir. Okay, I'm going to give you a formal email. Just repeat with me. 43 at gmail.com What is that? I'm sorry? 43 at gmail.com What is it? 43 at gmail.com Okay, sir. What is your name on the card? Timothy Williams. Okay, T-M-I-M-O-T-Y T-I-M-O-T-H-Y-I-A-M-S Right. Okay, sir. So just let me clear. Can you state your phone number for once? I'm sorry? What is your phone number? Can you state your phone number to confirm this? It's the number you called. Do you not have that? Can you Yes. 904220, can you repeat this? Can I repeat it? You just said it. Why do I need to repeat it? Uh, sir? I'm not, you're confusing me. I don't understand what you're doing. Okay, sir. Just let me clear. Sir, do you have a swimming pool or spa in your home? Do I have a swimming pool or what? A spa in your home. A spa? No, I, I don't have a swimming pool or a spa. Okay, sir. Just let me clear. What? We almost said. What so you will get also? You will get also seventy-two dollars, seventy-two dollars every month. How many dollars? Okay. Seventy-two dollars you will get. Okay. What am I getting seventy-two dollars for? I don't. I don't understand. Because because you are selected in a series. Premium plan we are going to give you right now. This is a premium plan in which you will get every month seventy-two dollars, and it is for twelve months. How many months? Okay, for twelve months. Okay. Yeah, this is a premium plan. Which plan? A premium plan. Is that right? Yeah. Yes, yeah, sir. Okay. Can you repeat, sir? Okay. Can you repeat your full number again? I'm sorry. Can you repeat the card number again for once? I have to confirm this. Oh, the card number? Oh, I put it away. Hold on a second. I can get it back out again. Hold on. Okay. Alright, I've got it. Okay, sir. It's 5178 0562-3184-8211. Eight two one six? No, eight two one one. 
Where did you get one six from? Yes. Yes, what? So do you have any other card? Because this is an invalid number, I see. It should look like an invalid number. What do you mean it's an invalid number? This is this is my one card I use for everything. Okay, so just hold on. I have to check this again. Okay. I don't know what you're doing wrong, but the card number I know works. Okay, okay, I got you, sir. So we almost done. If uh, in premium plan, you will get everything at uh, seventy dollar every month, and it is for twelve months. Okay, and also you will, if you had any problem with your appliances, you just need to call the company. And they will work for you, and free of course you will get repair. Okay, on your appliances, if you had any problem with your uh, with your appliances. What okay? what? What company do I need to call? You have to call it. I will call it company. This is Jeffrey Electric PUC. Okay, you will get everything by mail also. Just let me clear. What? Uh, what company am I supposed to call if I have a problem with my appliances? PUC Department of Texas. Okay. The City Department of, of what? Texas. Texas. Why do I need to call the City Department of Texas? I live in Florida. Yes, yeah, so this is a Florida Electric Cooperative. Okay, but we have to transfer the. You have to. I, I'm going to give you a number. You have to know the number, okay? Oh, okay, okay, I'm ready. Okay, sir. 611. Did you write that? 611. Yes, I wrote that down. What's next? Okay. And what number is that? So this is the number you can call the company. This is Electricity Company. PUC Department of Florida. You will get everything by mail also. If you had any problem with your electric city appliances, okay, you just need to call this number and they will secure and repair your appliances free of cost in premium plan, okay? What area code is 611? So this is a company number. Okay. What? I still don't okay. understand what company it is. So this is a Florida PUC Department of Florida, Public Utility Department of Florida. Oh, I thought you okay. said it was the Public it, Utility it, Department it, of it, Texas. It, it, It is under, it is run under in the Texas, okay? Texas, public utility, okay? I don't think you have a clue what you're doing. You do realize you're calling somebody in Florida, right? I don't know why Texas is even being brought up here. Uh, because Florida and Texas is a main department, okay? Why would so we I... Have to trust why would I call Texas in order to get service on my electric provider in Florida? Yes. That doesn't make any sense. Sir, the Texas department is the PUC Public Utility Department of Texas is the largest department of PUC. Well, okay. I'm, I'm sure in Texas and it Florida, is, but in Florida is, that means is, nothing. Yes, I know. But Florida, New Mexico, and Three or four or department are run under with Texas Public Utility, okay? The main branch of Public Utility of Texas is in Florida, okay? Run with Florida. I think you're just making that up. I don't think that's true. It's up to you if you don't take look like yeah, I, it's up to you. I think you're just making crap up right now. That's that's. I think you got confused and thought I was in Texas, and now you're just making stories up. So when do I? When should I get this money? By the way, so you will get everything by mail tomorrow, and your money two hundred and ninety dollars. Yeah. In a in thirty to forty minutes, okay. Thirty to I'm forty possibly, minutes. Uh, I will prosper your case finance department, they will work for you, and in 30 to 40 minutes, you will get your money, okay? All right, now in 30 or 40 minutes, if I don't have my money, should I call back? Yes. I should? 
and tell them I didn't get my money and I need my money? Yeah. Okay. Well, as long as you tell, as long as you say you're going to send me this money, can I'll, you, can, I'll... You state, can you state your phone number for confirmation? No, you already have my phone number. We've already said it like three times now. Can you state the number for once? I have to confirm from you. No, no, no. You already have it. You confirmed it already. Why are you asking me to? Do, why are you asking me to confirm uh, the same thing over again? Hello. Because this is a description. This is Hello? a recorded line. We have to confirm from you. That's why I'm asking you. Okay. You have to. You have to confirm from me. You've already confirmed my. Yeah. What? Hello, stupid. Are you listening? Yes, I'm listening. You are stupid. This is the dumbest Sir. conversation I've ever had in my life. You better just send me my money. Okay, I am sending the money before I have to confirm the number, otherwise we cannot for the proceed. This is lo Are you trying to tell me, if I don't tell you my phone number, one that you've already confirmed with me twice now, that I'm not going to get this for money? Once, for once, please do it. The answer to your question is no. We already did that. Why are you making me repeat myself, you idiot? Hello? Wake up! You're... Yes, I'm here. Can you repeat the number for or not? I can. I'm not going to. Okay. Okay. Then I cannot further proceed. You will lose the money. $290. Okay? Well, then give, me, to you. then give me my credit card information back then. Give it back to me. Okay. Just write your number. Okay, give it to me. Okay, 517. Eight zero five six two three one eight four eight two one one. Okay, and wipe that out of your system. Take it out of your system because I don't want you to use that card number. Okay, you're a, it's up you're, to you. you're a very mean man. You're a very mean man. I mean, if if you are a man, I don't know. You you could have a deep voice for a woman. Are you? Yes, sir, okay, for once. Yes. You have to. You have to confirm the number. That's it. I and have I to? Proceed. Who says I have Why to? You... Who says I have to? Who says I have to do anything? This is a free country, damn it. If I don't want to do something, I don't have to do anything. Okay, but this is a confirmation ID I have to ask from you. This is a recorded line. This is a recorded line? Record. Well, whoever's listening to this recording, just know that the person that I'm talking to right now, and I don't even remember your name, is a complete and utter idiot. He's got okay, he's got he's time. he's got less brain waves than 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 Abby. than a chicken a chicken. I could have come up with a better insult there, but I I couldn't think of it on my on the fly. Chicken, brain waves. Yeah, dumb. I know. I'm so glad they called. Hey everybody, and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way, and we'll catch you all next time.